welcome back to my channel so now um today's video is a food haul so we go to a different shops here in denmark and then we just buy some of the things that i need for my baking and some are just a daily use also and then yeah and then some is just my personal use so that's gonna start that's gonna start so this one we have the chocolate so we buy this one in Bilcaranas um, it's a budget more chocolate so it's that one and each of this chocolate cost 7.95 kroner so it will be around 8 kroner already so I buy how many more choc dark chocolate mm, let's see one two three four so i buy four dark chocolate so this dark, dark chocolate i can use this one for my baking one of my baking ingredients but sometimes um for my deep ganache i use dark chocolate uh, yeah, I used some dark uh, milk chocolate and then Yeah, just a white chocolate also so. Next is I also have the white chocolate. It's also four pieces of white chocolate It's still the same price and the next is the milk chocolate So it's here. So it's still four pieces of milk chocolate and then next here there's coke coke regular 1.5 liters so yeah i love drinking coke even though i have beauty eye still i love drinking coke so we buy this one in aldi just here near in the house it cost us 12 krona for this one and then next oh it's for my yeah personal use i have this saffron london nail polish vernis what's this i don't know how to read it now and then the color is purple first so that's it and next will be purple edge see i really love purple so also this one and next is french manicure white french manicure still safe run and then and then the clear one so next it's Matilde original. So it's like a cacao. Cacao, yeah, cacao, 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 something cacao, guys. <laughs> so yeah, my husband buy 11 pieces of this one because they put it down the price. And we bought this one in Bill Caranas. So this one. Love cacao, cocoa. And next is the Leia and Prince. So, ta-da! So this is my new baby. I love cooking also. Uh, aside of baking, I love cooking. And then I love, I love to make my own um, what do you call that one? My own version. Or I also love experimenting foods. Even though yeah, I just make my own world. <laughs> so next is sesame seeds i bought this one in spa just near also here in the house 
Um, I'm gonna use this one for my sushi and some of Korean foods because as we all know, Korean love to sprinkle um, sesame seeds. So, I forget the price on this one. So, next is the USB cable or charger cable. Because while I'm in the Philippines, my original charger for my Samsung S8, I destroy it. So sad. Um, I don't know why is it like that. Because the wire, the end of the wire, it's already breaking. So it's good that when I arrived here, it's still working. And then after a days, it will not work anymore so that's why my husband bought me this one in El Gigante just in Ranas also and it cost around 200 something 200 something Corona I forget the exact price and because I'm not the one who paid it <laughs> just my husband so next will be Tadam! it's it's for baking um this one I forgot how much is this we bought this one in we buy this one in Bilka and then I, I think around 79 krona or I don't know so this one you'll make it bigger and bigger I think you can make what's this 16 centimeter to 32 centimeter in this one and I'm gonna use this one on um, I'm gonna use this one on Saturday I know I'm gonna use this one this coming Thursday because I will bake earlier the, the wedding cake of my friend because she will get married this coming Saturday so I'll be the one to make for her wedding cake. So that's why I buy a new one. Because I have my old baking tools, but I need like three layers for her wedding cake. And I also buy this one. It's another um, baking tools. And then it's 20 centimeter. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I think the price for this one is 80 krona or something 99 krona it's still in bilka so i love baking and then the next one is the sushi nori it's also it's a dried um seaweed and then i'm gonna use this one for my kimbap or kebab kimbab or I don't know how to pronounce it but it's a kind of sushi um it's a Korean version of sushi it's that one yeah and then next is the this one I don't know how to pronounce it that one I really love the taste in this one we use this um as a side dish for like um what's the name i forgot <laughs> like flaska style mm, it's kind of porting they it's one of the food here in denmark and the first ever food that i loved the first time i came here in denmark so the next one <laughs> And also, I forget the prices with this one. Or most of my, the one I buy, I really forget the price. So next will be the mushroom. So I don't know, I don't know yet where can I use this one, but maybe soon I'll make a um, mushroom sauce, white mushroom sauce, I think. And it's ecologic, so I forget the price also. And the next one is the like cucumber, something cucumber salad. I don't know what it's called. I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> Sorry, because I'm still 
new with this country and I did not go to school yet so I cannot pronounce some of the words or most of the words here. So this one is also very good. One of my favorite side dishes also here and then. And next is the lime. So I can use this one for marinating my meat and if ever I can um, make a sauce also. So next one is the citron or the um, American lemon, the yellow lemon. So also the same as lime. And next is the bay leaves. So bay leaves, um, yeah, my husband buy this one also and we can use this one for coffee or you can just drink but without any coffee next is cucumber so cucumber um cucumber uh <laughs> i don't know i'll just use this one for also my kebab or sushi soon and the next is right oast or oast is it means cheese here in Denmark so this one my husband buy this one also because it's um, I'm gonna put it on her on his bread for um, um, for his what do you call that? lunch or no not lunch snacks for where they were and next is milk oh I really love their fresh milk here and then the they fatten it is 3.5% fat and this and then the thing is um, why I like the fresh milk here in Denmark than the Philippines because in the Philippines it's like more on full cream so it really not taste good for me and since when I came here in Denmark and my husband try let me try to drink this one so I can feel the difference because this one is really really fresh and then my husband told me before that their fresh milk like um, in the farm so they will they will take it from the cow and then after 24 hours all of the fresh milk that they get in the farm it's already in the store or some of the convenience store here so that's why i really love the taste because you can feel it that it's really really fresh and then they're also strict with the with the the label that when it will be expired so if like the due date of the expiration is the, today you really need to throw it out even if there's still more on it so that's why one of the prettiest thing that i love and i like here in denmark and then ah oh, so the last one is this one so there's a three kinds it's something to sprinkle on the cake um after or like for decorating there's a pink and this one and that i don't know the exact name of this one but i pretty like this one because it's useful for me like especially i'm baking and then if i'm tired doing my design for the ice cream i'll just sprinkle it with this one so i have pink and blue for it so that's all for today's food haul and personal haul for me so hope you enjoy and if you did not subscribe to my channel yet so please subscribe and hit the ring button or the bell button so that you will be notified from my next video and don't forget to click the thumbs up so thank you and see you for my next video bye